What's up guys, DCRC back here with another video. Today, I'm doing an unboxing of the Northwood Fingerboards, I think they're called the Snugs Wheels. They're made for the uh, Y trucks. But yeah, I needed new wheels and I thought the only, or the only wheels I should get are wheels that are made for the trucks I have since I do have Y trucks. Um, and they're dual bearing wheels, so it's like I'll give them a shot. So yeah, I ordered them um, on uh, Monday, I think, and it's Thursday right now, and I came in today. Let's pull everything out. Here it is. <laughs> Northwood always sends you like a little like shirt pin. I have two of them now. That's my second one. Here's a card. their information oh whoa what is this they sent me a sweet tool look at that very long handle with their uh, Y trucks key in on that that's pretty cool all right slide these out like there's stuff wrapped up in here there's tape right here Good lord, this is a kind of a crazy unboxing. They packed a lot of stuff in this little little thing. Right, here's my receipt. Oh my goodness, I got a ton of stickers. So there's my receipt. Uh, I got a Northwood High Performance Wheels Snug sticker. Huge. It's like the size of my hand. I got a Northwood's Sticker there, a couple snugs, more Northwoods, more Northwoods, that's a vinyl, this one is. Uh, more snugs, and three of these, good lord, I got a ton of stickers. Sweet, dude, they gave me three, three sheets of uh, clean sheets, North of Fingerwoods clean sheets. They gave me those last time, so now I have like five, because I've already used one of them. And it looks like here's the wheels, so... Sweet. So there they are. That's pretty cool packaging. I like how they're just stuck in one spot and they can't really play around. So it's, yeah, it's everything in this little bubble wrap ball. Alright, I'm going to get these out of the package now. And we'll get you guys showing up close to these things. I just thought I might as well unpackage them on video. So we're going to put down the camera a little bit and... Undo this on a video. Oh, cool. They actually come in a little Ziploc baggie. Just like that. Alright, they're out of the package now. And there they are. All right, I'm gonna get these on the uh, deck and see you in a second. All right, so here you can see them on the deck. And so I was coming from these, or not these wheels, I was coming from these broken knuckle wheels that are pretty bad. They're good for like five minutes, like two days, and then they're really crunchy, and then if you let them sit for like a month, then they kind of get their crunchiness out of them, and then you can, can use them for another couple days. But putting these on I noticed you can't put them too tight or else they the bearings will be squished together and they won't move and so you have to loosen them just a tiny bit and then they roll like a freaking dream you probably hear that it it just rolls amazingly well so yeah they're pretty pricey compared to like the five dollar whatever broken knuckle ones but I think they're well worth it after just rolling them once like, that's just barely a tap. And they're so quiet. And there's absolutely no crunch at all. Like, it feels like, it literally feels like you're just gliding your fingers in the air. It's so smooth. It's kind of crazy how smooth they are. But yeah, that's my quick initial uh, impressions of them. Again, or I didn't say this before, but there's absolutely no wiggle. 
on the wheel and the axle. There has to be a little bit really to make sure it rolls freely. But compared to these wheels, there's like hardly anything. Like those wheels were like would move back and forth like a millimeter. So yeah, first impressions are these things are incredible. I'm gonna get a sesh these with my DCRC deck. I'm gonna try the uh clean sheets grip tape again. It's been a while since I tried this stuff. But yeah. I'm going to get this one going, guys, and I'll see you guys in a review of these wheels in a couple weeks. See you guys later. Peace out.